The first poultry disease we are going to talk about is bacterial disease. Bacterial disease refers to a large variety of disease caused by any bacteria or bacterial components that affects humans, domestic animals, wildlife, fish, and birds, and poultry in particular. The first bacterial disease we are going to discuss is the cola bacillosis, a bacterial infection with avian pathogenic Escherichia coli or APEC. It occurs as an acute fatal septicemia or a subacute pericaritis and the air sacculitis. It is a common systemic disease of economic importance in poultry and is seen worldwide. Symptoms of a specimen affected by cholibacillosis are first a respiratory distress, next we have the weakness or a loss of appetite and poor growth. Prevention and treatment of these disease. Practice of efficient water sanitation methods and the use of clean drinkers are strongly advised. Provide adequate ventilation and manage the litter properly. Prevention of cholibacillosis relies on good management to decrease exposure of birds to APEC. The next bacteria disease we are going to discuss is the salmonellosis. This disease is transmitted vertically from parent flocks and affected baby cheeks with a high morality eventually. Symptoms are pasting of vent feathers, weakens, loss of appetite and poor growth, chickens are crowded and close to heat source and sit with drooping wings and their eyes closed. Whitish diarrhea are also noticed. Prevention and treatment. Ensure salmonella-free chicks from hatchery by using sterilized fish and meat meal. Pelleting of feed will also be helpful. Add forazolidone to the feed to control salmonellosis. Coriza. Coriza is a disease of chickens caused by the bacteria Avibacterium paragalinarium. Infectious coryza may occur in growing chickens in layers. Symptoms are swollen faces and swollen eyes, respiratory distress, poor feed intake are also noticeable, retards growth in young stock and reduced egg production in laying flocks. Prevention and treatment. Sound management practices and vaccination can help prevent infections. Avoid overcrowding and wet litter. Reduce the ammonia level by proper ventilation. Fall cholera, a contagious bacterial disease of birds caused by Pasturella multicida. It causes acute morality and a chronic superative necrosis. Symptoms are combs and wattles of poultry with this condition become swollen and bluish. Water nasal discharge and saliva dripping pinpoint blood spots on the heart and the woodenum and white spots on the liver are present. Whitish diarrhea are also noticed. Prevention and treatment. Good management practices includes a high level of biosecurity such as control rodents and ensure closure proper management. Nice is to provide good ventilation and stress-free conditions. Eradication of the infection requires depopulation followed by thorough cleaning and disinfection. Chronic respiratory disease or CRD occurs when chicken and turkeys that are infected with Mycoplasma galicepticum are stressed. The bacteria then cause major damage to the bird's respiratory system. The chronic respiratory disease or CRD is one of the most common causes of disease in backyard fowls. Symptoms are sniffling, sneezing, coughing, and other signs of respiratory distress. We have also the poor weight gain and the nasal discharge as symptoms. Preventions and treatment. Avoid overcrowding and improve ventilation of your enclosure. Ensure hatchery sanitation and screening of parent stock. Mixing tiamolin and tyrosin in the feed will be helpful. Good day. Thank you for listening.